hey guys welcome back to the channel today we will be doing a plan with me in my Erin Condren hourly life planner I will be using a printable kit this week this is from a new to me shop it's called pink planner shop or something like that I'll go ahead and link it just to be sure but this is this particular kit is called Alpine snow again the weather is crazy out here so um this kit definitely represents that i think it's actually snowing currently right now um i'm just going ahead and show you guys all of the pages that comes with the kit i actually didn't print out um one page because i just felt like that was too many pages to have plus um the little fashion boxes or whatever but if you are new to my channel, hi, my name is Cheryl. I am the owner of Really Sticker Co. And my channel is about everything sticky paper. Um, So if you are interested in that, don't forget to go ahead and give this video a like right now. Also, make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as the bell so that you're notified of when I upload next. Um, We are trying to get out at least three videos a week I have been a little off of my schedule but that's honestly because of my work schedule which you guys already know um once you see it again <laughs> that I am not too happy um, about it but hopefully we could get some um, changes made to it um so I am starting off with um, putting down the bottom washi out I'm also using the glitter headers um, from the kit and I am laying those down now child I love white out but sometimes when I white out um, I don't exactly get everything lined up but hey it is what it is that's what I do so <laughs> and as you can see that really pink one is like really crooked but if you do not lay something down crooked in your planner then you are not really a planner just saying Starting off with my date covers, um, I did have some date dots that I wanted to use, but I honestly call myself trying to organize and reduce all the paper waste that I have. Um, so my stickers are currently like all over the place, so I really just didn't feel like going through all of that and I know the date so I'm cool with it so I just laid down the glitter headers I'm gonna go ahead and start with my sidebar and this kit honestly it had so many options that I wanted to use um I don't I think this art is actually by um Sadie Piper Ooh, excuse me Sadie Piper I believe this is the artist um that this the actual um clip art is from um and this is one of the reasons why when it came to picking my full boxes it was like so because i like that i feel like all race and colors of women were represented in the fa fashion girls so when it came time for me to like pick my boxes i really didn't know what i wanted to do <sighs> So yeah, I just really like the colors and really the style of this artist. So it was a lot for me. But um, it's always funny to me when I use other shops formats, particularly when it comes to like the sidebar. I like to have my sidebar pretty functional. Um, and I pretty much have it down to the signs, the measurements. But then when I use other shop stickers I always have a hard time um figuring that out but I did go ahead and just put down some deco also my work schedule is again the same this week um pretty sure this is the last week that is like this hopefully if not then somebody's gonna have some hell to pay because I'm not with it um but this is what it is for right now I'm going to go ahead and put out the videos that I have planned for this week. I do have three that I do want to go ahead and get out. And I'm going to make it my business to get out because I have been putting down videos every week and I have only been getting out um, one video. And 
I'm not happy about that because I want to start this new year off with um, really putting things in priority for me. But I feel like I fell off the last couple of weeks with this damn work schedule. But I'm not going to keep talking about the same thing. So um, I have a plan with me that I have coming up, which is the one that you're watching right now. I also have um, a vlog, a studio vlog as well as a new re <laughs> new releases and I honestly didn't realize this is the week that I wanted new releases until I looked at my monthly view and I had it marked and I was like new releases hmm. it's not like I don't have things ready to go I just that just tells you where I am in my week um so yeah starting off with Monday it is Martin Luther King <sighs> Jr. day um and there is no school for the kitties, so I did go ahead and mark that. Um, and then I put that I did want to film a daily plan with me in my A5. I do like to put those on my Instagram as well as my TikTok, so make sure that you go ahead and follow me at Rally Secret Co. Um, if you're interested in seeing those. And I also put down that I am going to be working on new listings so that I can prep myself for the new releases that I have coming on Friday and that's at the end in the end of the night once I get home I did go ahead and use a full box to take up some space um because I do work on this day so it's not like I'm gonna get a lot of stuff done um during the day because I will be at work then we're moving over to Tuesday, which is my payday. And I started with the full box at the top. It's the one with like the um directions. Um and then I used the box to mark that Hallelujah School is open. Um so that will help me with getting a lot of stuff done as well. As well as it's my brother's birthday on the 18th. So I did want to go ahead and mark that. Also, I did use the Ombre 3 Heart Checklist just to mark down some of the videos that I either wanted to get started um, or film on this particular day. Then Wednesday, I did go ahead and take one of the tall fashion girls um and just put her there because I really don't have anything planned per se for mon uh Wednesday besides I have to pay a bill so I marked that um and that was the only thing really that I wanted to get done on this day just so I didn't forget and most of these things that I put inside of my hourly I do transfer to my a5 just so when i'm looking at my days as a whole i know for sure these are the top things that i want to get done on these particular days um moving right along to thursday i did put um that i have a doctor's appointment um well not a doctor's like a covid shot appointment on this day for my daughter so i did mark that as at the top of the morning because i believe it's like at 8 o'clock in the morning, which I'm going to be a little bit annoyed about because I don't know where this damn pharmacy is at, but I have to drive to it. Um, I also put a full box down there as well. I also marked that it is my niece's birthday on this date as well. And I marked for the millionth time. I'm sorry. I think either I'm burping or I'm tired. Honestly, I'm not tired. So I don't know why I was drawing it like that. Um, but, um, yeah, so I need to get air in my tires. I probably, if you have been watching the last couple of playing with me's, then you have seen that I have marked this every week inside of my planner, but I'm sorry. I don't even know what I left off at, but, um, We were at Thursday and I was saying how I needed to go ahead and get some air in my tire. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And then I also, during the damn snow, 
um, me trying to dig my car out, <laughs> I made a mistake and knocked off the windshield wiper, um, which I haven't even put back on fully. And here it is, it's snowing again. Um, so I did put that I wanted to go ahead and, um, get that fixed. Just if I don't do it no other day for sure, it needs to get done on, um, Thursday. Friday, I don't really have any plans at all. Um, because it's just one of those, it's like one of those days where the next day I, the two days I work back to back, so I don't have anything really planned. Saturday, um, I did want to go ahead and get all of my new releases printed, um, as well as I wanted to cut the next two kits that I will be using, um, for next week's plan with me as well as February monthly. Um, so I wanted to go ahead and do that. And then I did put that I wanted to do my nails. Hopefully I could do all of this before it's time for me to go to work. But honestly, I'm not going to try to kill myself to do it because if not, then I can just transfer it over to Sunday. I did go ahead, which you are not going to see now because we're just, I'm a little bit up ahead. Um, but I did go ahead and put down another full box there. It's just the one where it's a jacket and it's like some skiing and snow stuff. And then I went ahead and put up the double box that came in the kit. Now it was a huge double box that came on the fashion page kind of like if you ever seen glam planners double boxes um how it's huge like it mm, i wouldn't use that in my hourly if i was in a vertical then yeah um but sunday is pretty standard for me i go ahead and film um my plan with me as well as my monthly I do need to update my expenses in my um, budget planner, which oh, I know I haven't put out any more budgeting videos. And honestly, it's just because all of my stuff is jacked up and messed up. Um, and I have to figure out, well, by the time February comes, I'm going to have it all together. It's just that I had my job make a mistake on my paycheck then things that I ordered was messed up. Um, so I went to, I'll talk about this in the vlog. Um, but for the most part, I do want to get all of those things situated, you know, in these next two weeks before the new month starts, because I don't want any, um, excuses. And then I put down that I'm going to wash my hair. Maybe, maybe not. Um, uh, Hopefully, that's what I want to do, and I'm going to get done on this day. If it's not the hair, then it'd be the nails, but we are done going into the rest of this year looking scruffy. Um, And that will be it on the plans. After I open up. Um, the planner, I'm just going to show you all of the pages that I have left, have left over. And honestly, it's enough still to do another, um, spread, even without the extra page that, even as, after the extra page that I didn't print out, still had enough stuff to, um, left over that, honestly, I'm going to put it to a giveaway pile. Um, just so when I reach 500 subscribers, I'll go ahead and give that away to a lucky person, which if you see my container of leftover stickers, you'll be like, ciao, somebody going to be happy. Um, so that's going to be the end of today's video. Make sure if you haven't already that you go ahead and subscribe to the channel also, make sure that you follow me on my social media accounts. They're all at Relly Sticker Co. Um, and you can check me out on Instagram and on TikTok under that handle. If you are interested in checking out any stickers, my shop link will be listed down below. Make sure you go ahead um, 
and give this video a like also comment down below what your plans are for Valentine's Day I don't know that's the weird request but I just want to see, <laughs> I just want to see if anybody else out there is single like me I don't know enough of the rambling though I'll see you guys on the next one bye